Alright guys, there's a prison break at Bowling Brook. Uh, detectives and all other units are en route to that, so we're gonna head that way. We might seat build up. It's gonna be a current manhunt. Not sure what we're in for, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, I think this is the help here. Audience to advise, I just made contact with a guard saying suspect was last seen headed towards Harmony. Hey. Hello. Um, I guess he's not coming this way. Yeah, we might as well roll down that way, I guess. Yep. I'll follow you. We're gonna head down here. It sounds like they're going towards Harmony. All right, we'll follow some road rules. I'll see who else. All units be advised. Guard is advised. The escapee is in a black tank top, orange jumpsuit, pants, has a brown hair and a ponytail, and is a female. X-ray, 120, One of two, show me the area of Harmony. Metro 535 and 518 to 1097 in that area as well. All units also to be advised. Suspect has a rap sheet a mile long and is considered extremely dangerous. Not saying anything just here. Suspect's name is also going to be a one, Sandrina King. Ah, that's Katie and Juliana's mother. Their biological mother. So we kind of want to get her in custody because she is a very violent lady. Who else? So what was that a gunshot? That's a county unit. I don't think there was a gunshot. I thought I heard one, but maybe not. We'll check the 24-7. 3, 12, 5, one, eight. Uh, Did she leave in a vehicle, or was she still on foot? Guard said she was last seen on foot. Copy. No, so we're just doing a premises check. We got a couple of escaped convicts. If you see anything, just call no one. Okay. Thank you. Metro five thirty five. I just checked the twenty four seven in harmony. It's clear. riding around over there, but that's where the metro unit just came from, so I think they're just AI. Mm -hmm. Put our seatbelt back on. 102518, I'm already up here, there's nothing up here looks like. Chain 4, I'll stick on Sonora right now. 102, I'm going to do a quick swing to the construction site. 213 from 535, you want to come back here to the old motel, uh, sorry, the motel here on Harmony. Right. Shannon, right. 
Might just do some checks. Hey, you want to just do some door knocking around here? May have come in here or, you know, barricade themselves in one of these rooms. Mm. Yep. Knock, knock, LSPD! LSPD, anybody home? Hmm, no response. I'm gonna go for the next one. Yeah. Alright, I'll try the next one. I'll come back on my way out. Let's speedy, anyone in? LSPD! Can you open the door for me? LSPD! LSPD! Just doing some door knocking but nobody seems to be home. Which is... You know how it is sometimes I guess. Actually like what Brandon did, room 7, we'll go with that. LSPD! Anybody home? Knock knock, LSPD! Uh, n no luck either. No, oh, no there's luck. one more. Room 8. Oh. Knock knock, LSPD! County 102, Redwood Lights tracking dirt roads Anyone with the prisoner, all clear. This is the police! Oh. Lol, 78 because I forgot to delete these 7, good. Nothing. No one's in. I think everyone's out. Yep. I'm gonna go on the dirt roads. Um, it's possible they could have made it nearly, yeah. Yeah, head towards the airfield and maybe Sandy, Joshua sort of area, maybe. Did yeah. Mitchell yeah. just see something? Because he just whipped it out of here. Uh, nope. 312 from 535. Did you just see something? No, but I got some other locations I was gonna check. Go we. 535, show me back. Um, available from the motel. That turning radius. Oh! Alright, no one's there. We're gonna head towards. 213, I'll be searching the dirt roads behind the airfield. We're gonna head towards Sandy, I think. And we'll go from there, I think. It's probably the best thing that's gonna happen. I believe I have that suspect at Mirror Park. I had a feeling that you would come down here. 535 is in route, one minute out. 102 same traffic. 120 same traffic. 128 same traffic. 213 same traffic. 312, 535, is it around your house? Uh, Mirror Park Lake. Copy. Five ten nine seven in the air. Well, I love to get tickets to Bang or Shame, but that is my favorite. Suspect is currently armed with a knife. 
postal. Four three one. It's over, Sandrine. I put it up. One zero three, San Traffic. Sandrina, it's over. He just making it worse. Hands up. Yeah, she's walking north right at the moment. God, we have plenty of civilians in the background as well. Just charged at 128. Has anyone got a non lethal? I've only got a fucking Glock. I've got a non lethal out now. Hands up. Put your hands up. Sandrina, give it up. It's literally over, sweetie. Put your hands up and give it up. Put your hands up. Can we get a taser on her? Sandrina, put your hands up or you're going to be tased. Taser. Taser deployed. Watch crossfire. Don't, don't move or I'll shock you again. Put your hands up now. Hands up, up, Sandrina. Hands up it's over. Face, face away. Do not walk towards us. Put your hands up now. Face away from me. Put your hands up now. Size deployed. Size deployed again. Suspect down. Sandrina, hands up. Put your. There you go. No, Subject complying. Sorry, I got cover. One zero three subject secure. Ten fifteen. Scene ten ninety eight. Anything else on you? Not gonna answer your question. That's us she's coming yeah. back for Julian. Oh, yeah. Blaine County's running up. Yeah, most so likely. Come over here. Is she here? Is she in the area? I don't know. Um, well that was interesting. Hmm. Gotta figure out how she even got out of prison first. Yep, I might, uh, might go back up there later and, uh, force them to give up the evidence. Yeah, the main thing is she's in custody. Um, we'll walk back to your cruiser. Yeah. Okay. Um, she had a knife. Oh. I'll wait for Mitchell to come over this way. I don't know if she was armed. Yeah. I'm pretty sure he said she had a knife, so she didn't have it in her hand then, so maybe she dumped it over here. 312 to 535 or 128. Go ahead. Are you going to want to question her? Uh, stand by. Did she have a gun or a knife on her at all? She had a knife when I showed up. She dropped it over where she was when you guys first showed up. Copy. It was in that bush where she went when you and I were gun pointed at her. Uh, she, she dropped it while she was still on the footpath. Copy. Sorry, I think I've got that. 
up now. Um, I mean, we can ask her questions, but we don't really... She's an escaped fugitive who's going back to jail. It's not really necessary, really. Well, she may or may not have shanked somebody. That's what we got to figure out. But other than that, I... Uh, what do you mean she may or may not have shanked? She either shanked somebody or she didn't. Metro 312. Well, from what the guard said, the uh, someone shanked a guard, but they wouldn't tell me who, and apparently they didn't know a lot. Yeah, they weren't very helpful at all. 1071. To my location. Uh, okay. Um, There's postal 430 right. for taser I'll prong removal. Try and ring him up and get some stuff out of them, I guess. Yeah. Did you, Two, twelve, did you, you got go another to female here. Yeah. Was she involved? I don't know. I technically, yeah. she's uh, um, basically where. Did you want to head back down there? And I'll give him a phone call and tell you to yeah. tell him to give you everything that they need to give you. Black, black yep, I'll, uh, yeah, I'll do that now while you're standing here. Should be one Juliana plays. Okay. Target. Uh, dispatch, can you patch me through to comms, uh, sorry, to the telephone for Bowling with Lieutenant Henry? Uh, 5 Uh, Salute Lieutenant Henry, badge 535. Yeah, I'll hold. Yeah, this is Lieutenant Henry. Um, Detective uh, Roberts is going to head back down to Bolingbrook. Um, I'd, I'd appreciate some cooperation between you guys and the LSPD and you give us CCTV footage and everything else that you failed to give us in the original of the scene. Thank you. Your cooperation is noted and Detective Roberts will be en route down there now. Jackass. Okay, well, I'll, uh, I'll head down there. Alright, if there's any other issues, give me a phone call. Yeah, or I might just phone the... our, uh, district judge. See what they say about that. Yeah, it sounds like they're gonna cooperate now, but let me know. Okay. Okay, I'll head over there. Alright, I'll go and ask her some questions, I guess. Consuelo's confirmation We're going to ask her if she shank anybody, like. Anything on her, Mitchell? No way, Eli. I work no, she didn't have anything on her. Well, Sandrine, just so you know, you Detective Roberts is going back down to Bowling Brook, which is where you'll be going back to. But um, she's going to go and get the rest of the CCTV footage and, you know, the rest of the cooperation she needs to finish this investigation. So, you want to tell us what happened down there at Bowling Brook and how you got out of the prison? Uh, Shannon. Depends, you're gonna get me medical? Yeah. Um, did they find a knife on Medical it? still a couple minutes. Uh, out. Officer McGee found a knife over on the footpath, I believe. You found a knife. Uh, you found right? a knife? Yeah, if, um, um, it was on a footpath, like I said. Um, she, the daughter says that her mother here was coming at her with the knife. Um, and no. apparently we need to check on her because she bad. took a knock or something. I'm not sure. Uh, I mean, if you really want, okay, I've uh, got a med bag have... in my uh, truck back there with a pair of pliers and we just yanked them out right here. That fine, but apparently the mother yeah. took a uh, hit or something. Yeah, she was hit. The words were exactly, she took a hit. I, I don't know if she, that's what she meant, but yeah. Yeah, that's a... Mm, pulling out six pounds of pair of pliers. I take the knife? Yeah. It's just that she may have shanked uh, a prison guard, and we're trying to figure out if it was with that knife or not. Yep, right, uh, uh, it's right here. Prongs Been... in, so, you know, complaining. I haven't really looked at it, to be honest. So uh, the daughter's, like, behind the bushes over there, near the tree, if you want to talk. Okay. I'll go and talk to okay. her. I'll let uh, Shannon let you deal with, yeah, the scene. I'm going to go back to Bolingbrook. They weren't very cooperative today, so... Uh... I don't really care about talking to her. She's going back to jail anyway. Star's going to get the rest of the info that hopefully we need from the prison, so... There's not a whole lot to investigate in terms of her, and she doesn't even want to cooperate anyway. She's like, no, I'm not talking until I get medical attention or whatever, so... Fuck up. Hey. Can 
know if I can kneel. Yeah, I can. Hey, Juliana, it's Shannon. How are you? You want to talk about it? I really much more to discuss. Okay, so what what were you doing down in the pond? I always come down here. Okay. It's the chill spot, basically. Okay. And your mother found you down here. She pulled up in some vehicle, got out, came at me with a knife. Okay, do you know what vehicle she got out of? Should still be sitting right behind us. Okay, do you know which car it was? There's a, quite a few cars up there. <laughs> you know what color it was, or how many doors it had? Anything like that? Mike? That's. Uh, if we're black something, I don't know. It's a. You said four door black? Yes. Is it like literally behind us? Um, yeah, it should be, or it was. Alright. I haven't she seen it. She went away for a short time and came back again. Okay. Alright. So, so what happened? You were just sitting down here at the pond and she just came down to you? Well, I heard a door behind me. I don't really trust people behind me, if I hear that. I stood up, looked around, and she's walking towards me with a knife. Okay. And whereabouts were you standing when she came at you with the knife? Right here. Okay, right in this spot here? Right around here. Mm-hmm. Wander over there to that bench. Okay. So, from that time, how long, how many more minutes was it till Officer Mitchell came to the scene? Not too long. Okay. Did you ring Officer Mitchell? Uh, he gave me some watch. All I had to do was just press a button on it and it'll tell him where I am. Right, okay. And then what happened when Officer Mitchell got here? I mean, she didn't listen, she ignored his commands, the only command she actually listened to was drop on the knife. Okay, okay, so let's go back a little bit. Just before Officer Mitchell got here, your mum came down here with a knife and she aimed it at you. Did she say anything? She didn't say anything. I told her to stay back. Okay. And she didn't say anything at all? Yeah, that, that, that didn't... Not that I heard. Okay, she just just came down here and just pointed the knife at you and you just told her to stay back. She had the knife in her hand. She didn't really have it. I don't think she had it up to do something, but it's in her hand. Knowing how she's been in the past. Okay, my next question is, when I got here you had a gun. Do you carry a gun? I literally five, 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 just five, found five. that one today. So you found the gun that you had? I had that suspicion. Yeah. Hey, uh, three Charles calling. Can you just find out what he wants? Um, okay. So, whereabouts did you find the gun? Two Charles, good for 535. Uh, it was down in the water in the canals. <laughs> And you found it like how long ago how long ago did you find it? Uh an hour or two before all of this. Okay. Did Scott know you had a gun on you? He wouldn't have known. He wouldn't have known. So he only found out when he got here and you had a gun as well, okay? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Okay. Uh what's up? Uh Scott wants to know if you should put the female into your vehicle. Uh, it's gonna be a bit before I leave. If some, if he wants to take it down to the station or whatever, um, 
So uh, Roberts has just gone down to Bolingbrook to get CCTV footage and we'll go from there whether we even interrogate her or anything. Copy that. Uh, 312. Um. Right. Well, you're safe now, Juliana, okay? She can't hurt you and she's going to go back to jail, okay? That's just been said many times. Clear it's not the case. Mm. I, I know. I know she's done some horrible things, but I'm, I'm sure this will be the last of it, okay? Yeah, well, she's going to be feeling it. What was that? Yeah, well, she's probably feeling it. Okay. Um, do you want anyone to take you home, or you... Do you need anything to drink? I just, I, I just need to be left alone for a little bit. Okay. Alright. Oh, um, what a day. Yeah, I mean, send you a cheese. What was that? Certainly a cheese. I and mean, I was still looking up in Harmony when the call came in. Oh, I drove, we started door knocking on the old, on that motel where um, me and Mitchell and Ahmed were. And um, I had a feeling that she may have come towards the city because of Juliana and Katie. So I started to come back this way and then that's when Mitchell radioed. Seems we were thinking on the same path. Yeah, I can talk to you later about why I headed this way. I'm aware why he's headed this way, Juliana told me. Oh, okay. Um, you might want to talk to her in right, a moment, well, she's a little upset. Checking up, I bet. Hey, Juliana. What? Whereabouts is the gun? We're in the grass. In front of us. Okay. Alright. You'll be right, kiddo. Alright, um... Roberts has gone down to get CCTV footage and try and get some cooperation from the prison because they weren't willing to cooperate earlier. So we'll see how she goes with that. Um, Ahmed, do you want to put her in your car and take her down to Mission Row and I'll follow behind you? Alright. Alright. Let's do that then. You want to hang out here, Mitchell? Yeah, I'll hang out here and talk to Juliana. Alright. Um, I've got all I need, but if you just want to get a written statement once she's calm down just a little bit. Yep. Alright, good job guys. Oh, I'll clear off. Stay safe. Yep, you too. You too. Yep. Oh, oh. I'll bring my car over. Yep. I'll let you do the transfer and I'll head down a mission. I have to talk to Roberts as well. All right. Henry. Uh, so uh, they gave me the CCTV footage. Uh, it was Sandrina. She she used that knife she had on her to stab the guard and stole his pass key and uh, keys. Uh, there weren't too many guards around, so that's why she got away so easily. She used his, uh, his information to leave, so she was the one who uh, assaulted the guard. Okay, do you want to interrogate her? I mean, it's pretty open and shut if it's caught on CCTV footage. We don't really need to question her. She's already in prison for life. There's not really any point interrogating her. Yeah, not really. I mean, Two we have enough to charge her for, yeah, one for time, life. 15, we know she did it. Room. Yeah, I'll just do the... Yeah, yeah, alright, we'll do that then. Um, you heading back to Mission Row and we'll meet up there? Yeah, yep, I'll be uh, en route. Okay, sounds good. Metro 535, show me in route to Mission Row PD. 
All right, we're gonna head back to Mission Row. Uh, still was skeptical. I don't know if we will interrogate her, to be honest. We have enough evidence with or without her statement. She's already in prison for life. 